My name is Stefan Gigac. I'm the editor of the Cardine Studies Journal, which is a journal that was academic journal, peer-reviewed journal that we've launched in partnership with ATF Press. The aim is to provide a platform for people who are doing research on various issues related to Joseph Cardine and the Joseph movements, the movements and initiatives that grew out of the Cardine method, including the young Christian workers, the young Christian students, adult Christian worker movement, and so many other things grew out of those movements. Uh, since the young Christian workers was a worker movement, it never had a strong academic background. More recently, many people have started to study Cardine's work from an academic point of view, and Cardine himself left a tremendous intellectual heritage. The Cardine Studies Journal aims to offer a platform to established and new researchers doing re work in this field, as well as people who have been involved in those various um, initiatives over the years to share their experience and testimony. The Joseph series is a new series of books which aims to prevent original material relating to or by Joseph Cardine, the founder of the Young Christian Workers Movement. The first book in the series is going to be called Lay People Into Action, which is a reprint of a book first published in English in 1964 under the title of Layman Into Action. In the original French, it was called Lake and Premier Ligne, Lay People in the Front Lines. It was published during Vatican II, the Second Vatican Council, in a bid to have an influence on the bishops who were gathered and the theologians who were working to draft the documents of Vatican II. The second book in the series is an important book about the philosophy of the French philosopher Alphonse Gratry, a 19th century philosopher who contributed enormously to what we now call the inductive method.